Executor, the Urash is secured, and the UED has given up the chase. We are currently holding perimeter orbit over the planet Char. Zeratul, have you locked onto the location of the Callus? Yes. I remember sensing his power the last time I was on this world. However, our sensors indicate a massive, fluctuating energy signature at its location. I am, however, unable to identify the signature's source. That should be obvious, gentlemen. The source is the Overmind itself. When the Cerebrates merged together, they must have locked onto the Callus energies and nested near it. It's probable that there'll be a number of broods protecting that area. It's risky, but if we can strike hard and fast, we might be able to fight our way through their defenses and escape with the crystal. Comrades, I may have an alternative. Seeing as how the Overmind is still in its infant stages, I wonder if we might be able to disrupt its control over those broods. If we can do enough superficial damage to the creature, it might pacify the Zerg nearest to it, allowing us some time to retrieve the Callus. A bold plan, young Artanis. Your courage rivals that of mighty Tazadar himself. You give me too much credit, noble Zeratul. I am not worthy enough to even speak his name. Touching. Look, boys, either of these plans will work, but let's not waste any time. I'll be able to exert limited control over a few of the Zerg here and provide you with some backup. But the longer we stay, the more we risk losing both the crystals again. Agreed. Executor, deploy your forces. May Adun be with you. Everyone, right, well, welcome back to some StarCraft. I would get some Zerg in. I mean, we might as well. I can't really think of any combinations of units, though, that Zerg and Protoss have good synergy with. What can we even build with this? We go up to Hydralisks. We build Hydra Zealot? Best combo ever. It's fun when you do, like, Terran and, uh, and Protoss, though, because then it's like, uh... So it looks like they have the gas, but not a lot of minerals. But a lot of minerals here, but no gas. Oh, let's go make an extractor, because that's going to be one of the first things we need. Uh, so this one is a bit of an interesting mission. This, one, this one's fun. So uh, we can either send this overmind to, into remission, uh, so, so whatever. Or we can go and get the uh, callus crystal over here, return it with the drone. Um, both are okay. Uh, looks like these overlords I don't think I can make into anything interesting. Let me see, what else do we have? We can get potentially mutalisks or something. Yeah. I, I want to do something with Zerg though, because Zerg are fun. We also have a shield battery. You know, I always say I want to use shield batteries and then I never do. It's kind of how I roll. Alright, fine, let's go make a layer, and then, uh, I guess we'll decide what to make these things into from there. Actually, yeah, let's make another, and then we'll make a spore over here. <laughs> oh, lurkers! Right, a new, pro a new brood war unit. Uh, basically, uh, really, it's a hydralisk upgrade or whatever the fuck it is. Maybe we can get that here. That sounds fun. Let me see if I can get a... Uh, I'm gonna get some Hydras. I'm gonna, I'm gonna focus mostly on Zerg just because we do a lot of Protoss right now. It's nice to take a little bit of a break from, uh... From the Pro... From the... From the Protoss. But unfortunately they're really gas heavy, so I don't know how much I'm gonna be really be able to do with that. Um... Uh, wait. I don't think they can even see my guys, so... Get over here. Okay, just take the scout real quick. Stealth! I'm waiting. Hopefully an overlord doesn't come anytime soon. Yes! Haha, <laughs> overlord! I fucked your plans. Alright, let's see what's over here. Uh, some zerglings burrowed and shit like that. Let's keep, uh, let's keep making miners, though. 
Uh, what I always like to do though is sometimes like what I'll do is um, basically the, uh, anytime I, I started in a campaign with two races, I'd have one be my slave race. And they would just make all the units for the other. <laughs> They'd make all the workers so I could like go max out 12-12 on carriers or some shit. That stuff was fun. And it looks like we can come down here anyway, so it's okay. And we'll make some of these guys. Actually, I, I don't I, I I can't get a hive, so I can't really do anything aerial wise. So I'll, I'll probably just do hydralisks. Let's see. I want to get this expo over here, so. That's why we're pretty much bringing everyone over here. Well, maybe we'll do like zealots and, uh, and hydralisks. That sounds fun. Something you don't hear very much in the the campaign here. Okay. Da 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 da. -da. I'm gonna send these guys in. Because Dark Templar do a hell of a lot of damage, and if they go underneath the radar, it's all the better. We're all the better for it. Oh god, it's dead. Kill him. So with this base, we'll be we'll be able to get this fucking. I hate this guy. These sunkins are like the worst. Well, it looks like uh, we're gonna have a bit of trouble here. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. I wasn't intending for that to happen, really. But we'll just bring everyone down here. And make continue to make zealots. And probably make... You know, let's just make a shit ton of zealots, and then, like... We'll, uh, we'll have fun with that. We'll just... We'll, we'll storm the overmind with zealots, okay? I'm probably saying it wrong. It's like zealots, or whatever. We, we have a lot of minerals, so let's do that. that sounds fun. And we'll get another up ground weapons upgrade. So I never did do that. I'm sad that I never did. Okay, we'll get faster faster hydralisks as well. And also faster overlords as well. You know, we could kinda like like one thing you can do, one little strategy I've, I've employed before is you make as many overlords as you possibly can. Then you take one drone and and put it inside an overlord. You take the callus crystal and then bring it back to I don't know where you bring it back to. You bring it back somewhere, let's just say that. What's the objective? I think you bring it back, right? Uh, retrieve, yeah, you retrieve it, so maybe not. You just have to, br you have to just bring a drone here, so. Once again, it's it's one of those cheap tactics you can kind of do to, uh, uh, to just kind of bring, like, take him out, like, immediately. It's good times. You know, this is probably the worst strategy to have on this map in particular, because, uh, it just occurred to me how much, uh, uh, lurkers are probably gonna fuck this strategy of mine. But I don't think they have anything like devourers or anything special. You also have to kind of position your, uh... Okay, I think, I think now actually this will work, so... Let's everyone go. Take out that base, everybody. Charge. Okay, we're going to do increased attack range and some ranged attacks here. God, we, you know, one pylon is seriously not enough for the amount of units I'm creating here. Why are these zealots so slow? Oh god! No, no, no! Don't, don't, don't destroy me! Okay, I think we got this now. Luckily, this this guy's right here, so. And, oh no! Well, hopefully there's gonna be no more, uh... Oh god, I, I, I'm gonna need a robotics bay. Or I could bring overlords along. Actually, that's a good idea. Bring overlords along. They're a little bit more robust. So one of the things you can do is you can kind of juke out. Uh, you can, you can juke them out. Make them come after you. The AI is not very smart. No, everyone keep running. Run back here. And there you go. We juked him. 
we're gonna continue making stuff uh, and make some more uh, pylons, hopefully. And did I say I was gonna make? No, 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 I wasn't gonna make robotics. I have, I have Zerg right here. Oh yeah, that's right. They have this weird thing there where um, it's they have most of the keys on this are like is are on the wrong side of the keyboard. It's interesting. This is how the uh, old StarCraft games used to work here. Um, it's kind of interesting because, you know, when people tout the advantages of uh, PC games and stuff like that, they talk about the keyboard and how, like, you know, oh, you get so many button combinations. But realistically, the, the most useful keys are the ones that are, like, Q, W, E, R, T, like, just basically the half of the keyboard because otherwise I'm just kind of, like, reaching my hand over there and I have to kind of look, maybe. You know, you kind of can't really tell which one's O or whatever. It takes you a little bit longer. It's not exactly what you want for games, right? It was, um, but yeah, so that's, it's like a little bit of an interesting thing. So in, in StarCraft 2, however, they fixed that and basically made it so uh, it's, it's all right. You don't have to worry about that because it's all on the left side of the keyboard. There's a good reason for doing that. And I, I still didn't get Zealot speed. Zealot, Zealot, whatever. All right. Let's just bring everyone over there. I really want Zealot speed. I think everybody says Zealot or Zealot differently. So we are going to so kick that over my ass into submission with like the most basic units. It's gonna be embarrassed. Embarrassed over mind. Oh, evolution is complete. Which is just missile attacks. I don't really know why I did that, but yeah, it's me. Now the, the interesting thing about um, about these these um, armor and weapon upgrades is that they're most actually effective on. Uh, against and for units that don't do a lot of damage, uh, that do quick attacks, basically. Um, like something like hydro upgrading Hydralisk armor or, uh, or any armor in particular is more effective against, like, Zerglings and shit than it is, uh, than it is Zealots. Like something like a tank, it's not gonna do shit against, right? Like, oh god, plus one armor. Yeah, good luck. It's a giant shell. It's every individual attack, that's why, like, Zealot attacks are... It's not technically... Oh god, he's so dead. Micro! Micro! Oh cool. Oh yes, he's helping. This guy's got this. Alright, and this upgrade is complete, so you know what? Let's just, uh, let's bring everyone down there to uh, attack. There's no way this can go incorrectly. I wonder if I could just run them all the way down there. I'm just gonna bring them individually to just follow guys. Hopefully we'll be okay. This is why you have as many of these guys as humanly possible. Because they'll eventually break through the lines. It's like, I mean, it's not a huge force of guys, but you know. I, I am, like, coming straight into, like, their their front door. Okay, just go over here, guys. No, uh, don't, don't kill my overlords. Micro! Oh, God. Ah! Well, there you go. There, go, there, go, there goes my detection. Fuck it, let's just go for the overmind. Oh god, it's heavily defended. Oh god, that was a horrible idea. Wait, what are you guys doing over here? You fucking useless. God damn it, they're all slowed down too. Well, that didn't work. Okay, I guess we're gonna go after the crystal now. Because that, that that went so terribly that I've, I've changed my mind. Actually, no, no, I haven't changed my mind. Fuck that. We, you know what we need? We need to bum rush with more zealots. That's what we need. Actually, what, what what happens if we just go straight after it? Let's try that. Let's fuck everything else. Just let's go kill that thing. I know they're coming in single file, but I'm pretty sure they'll make it. So far, it's not looking really good. Cause look at look at this p awesome pathing of these guys, and they're all getting hit by lurkers. I mean, they're almost making it there. Especially these, these guys too, because they're ignoring everything else. 
Well, at least they're actually making it there, but it looks like they're not gonna do much when they get there. Here I was thinking we could do like the most basic of units and uh, and actually win this. Apparently not. I think I'm gonna need more hydralisks to be honest. Now that I think about it. So this is mass hydralisks. That sounds good actually. That, that's the real thing I actually need. And it, we're gonna evolve whatever carcabus, carapus, carcabus, whatever. Just keep, make, keep making these because these are like the easiest things to reinforce is those guys and so I guess the Protoss are my slave race like look at this dickish thing they do with the Queens constantly they have that ensnare ability okay, no just let them come to us fuck it so after a couple of uh a couple of those guys I'm gonna go off and attack the overmine because then we can actually handle all that shit, but we can't right now. Not At least not in their current state. They won't be able to do it. Okay, we'll bring uh, an Observer here too. They're very slow though right now. I can even, I, I, I can even increase their like sight range and everything, but you know. It's one of those things. This was always easier. This was always the easier course of action. Um, I just realized. Because as I said, you don't have to kill anything when you rush down there. You just have to bring in one unit, uh, and you just. I think they have like a bunch of, bunch of scourges, but if you have enough distractions, then it works. You don't have to. You don't have to concern yourself with such things. All right, let's see. You know what? Let's let's start going in with uh, Alpha Squadron here of of Hydralisks. Evolution complete. Keep doing upgrades. Now I feel like I should save these guys for the final wave then. And we'll just send these guys in with them. Okay. Let's start pushing in. So with a bit of clever micro, hopefully. We'll be okay. Okay, let's push him back. There you go. See, look at that. I like that. That's nice. You fucking piece of shit. Honestly. Like, who here likes queens? Honestly. They're terrible. Should have never been born. I, I keep pressing V for overlords because I keep thinking that's what it is. God damn it. Lord, go over here. Oh my god, it's fucking gonna just piss me off, aren't you? Alright, well, we, we made it pretty well over here. We got managed to get one spine thing off. Now, I'm pretty sure we can actually make it there, almost. Okay, we're just gonna make a couple more hydralisks. Oh my god. It's so fucking annoying. Okay, and we have like a ton more uh, hydralisks right here, so we're just gonna bring them right with us there. Okay, wait, everyone fall back, everyone fall back. Okay, so right now it's just kind of become unmanageable. For us, this is why we move them back. Let them come back into us. While we focus down specific units. Even the overlord, look how, look how slow these overlords go. It's like fucking painful. But, uh, you know, I'm pretty comfortable with this right now. Alright, we're just gonna keep moving in. Okay, take out that guy. That's most annoying. Yeah, let's bring everybody down here before we continue our attack, because it's like right there, too. So, everybody can now come down here. I don't have to worry about it anymore. Fortunately, certain retarded uh, units are going to just continuously get killed. 
Hi, Defiler. Oh, they're so cute when they try to... They think they're people. All right, uh, let's go bring all the Hydralisks down here, too. Okay, I think this is a good enough force to actually go and just target the Overmind. Um, we're going to target the Overmind. Well, actually, no, we're not going to target the Overmind. What are we even doing? We got this. So we're just going to go target. Get in there, everybody. It's just, there's so many units that, like, I don't even know what the fuck. You can feel some of them dying, like, well, hear them dying, not feel. Well, if you can feel them dying, let me know, because uh, I can't really fix that. Looks like that one went much better when I actually tried to micro a little bit better and uh, let's move these guys back. Let the, let the Guardian come up to us. They have some really powerful units here, but it's no match for Zolid Hydra combo. Goodbye, Overbind. You'll be missed. Executor, the callus is ours. Let us depart this wretched world and return to Shakuras. Provided there is still a Shakuras to return to. It's pretty badass, you just kind of scooped it up. Alright, that's it for today then. Uh, I guess I'll be seeing you next time.